Well, this one has been epic for very different reasons from last year's 61 58 shootout in Waco. This game has been played in a downpour throughout. Neither team scored an offensive touchdown from the middle of the first quarter until the first overtime. And now Baylor needing a touchdown to send it to a third overtime, faced with a fourth down and one at the 16 yard line. Now they're going to come back in a set that looks like they might go for quarterback sneak. Johnson, the quarterback, is 235 pounds. He's going to hand it off to Chafin. He's taken down for a loss. TCU wins. Baylor's hopes of a Big 12 title and a shot in the college football playoff gone. And it's fitting that it was number 42, Ty Summers, once again, coming from his middle linebacker spot. He's done it all night. See you fans storming the field. And those fans deserve a lot of credit for sticking it out. First Back look at that play, Dave, where you, Ty Summers from his linebacker position, 42, he squeaks through there. And you're going to see that's Julius Lewis from his corner position, unaccounted for into the backfield. But Summers, all game made these plays and you got to give him credit fighting through all the injuries defensively they lose both starting Mike linebackers and he played his tail off. What do you think of the call the deep handoff rather than the, the quarterback's name. I'm fine with the call. I mean it's a short yarded situation. What else are you going to do. I mean they tried the quarterback sneak and that got stuffed. Yep. It wasn't the play call the reason why they didn't get that fourth down. It was the fact that TCU's defense was up to the task. Gary Patterson so proud of his defense they have lost just about all of their starters from last year's team due to graduation or injury. And our Bryles knows their shot of making the playoff and winning a Big 12 championship are over. 28 21 the final Sports Center is coming up next. Stay tuned for more from Fort Worth. Brian Greasy, Tom Lugan, Bill, I'm Dave Pash. So long for now. Steve Levy, John Butchergross, Sports Center.